All right, welcome back everybody. Uh, this is video number eight, uh, where we are uh, building our garage, where we can modify different parts of the vehicle. Okay, so we've done the tire and the suspension windows. Now we're gonna look at the engine, okay? So in the engine, we can do two things, all right? I'm gonna do a video for each one of them. The first one we're gonna do, which is the top speed, we're gonna do that in this video, okay? So basically it means when we, using this slider, we can increase the top speed of this vehicle. So what we're we looking at? Well, down here on our car, uh, which is using the car controller script. This is um, from the um, uh, from the Unity assets. Uh, this is the uh, car, the standard car prefab. Okay, that comes with the Unity assets um, vehicles. Right. So let's have a look. So if we look at that value there, we can see we change our top speed from 50 to 100 or anywhere in between. You can have those values at anything you want. So look at the slider. There's a slider that goes with this. Okay, and um, basically we've got window engine here and here's my slider top speed 50 100 you can change the values here all right now let's have a look at the script that does this right this is a little bit different and because we are accessing the um, actual vehicle car controller this script here all right we need to do a couple of things to allow us to access those values in our own script so let's have a look at the script and what we have here is we have our um, our engine script all right so first of all at the top yeah we're going to say right we need to get to the unity asset standard assets vehicles car all right and then what we need to do yeah is we basically need to get the um we need to get the car control get the car con car controller all right from there okay so here if we have a look i've said our oh, car controller and i've called it car all right and here I've got uh, a float, which is the top speed, and I've got the slider, uh, which is also called top speed, all right? Great. So if we look down, first thing we're going to do in a wake is we're actually going to get the car controller. Okay, we need to get this car controller. And then once we've got the car controller, we need to access the, um, the top speed value from it, okay? And I'm going to go through this quickly, right? So firstly, right, what we do is we say, well, what's our current top speed, right? And now if it's a new install, it'll be zero. So what we do is we say, if it's less than 50, we'll call it 50, right? So when they first do their first install, top speed of this vehicle will be 50. And then basically we're going to set this value to 50, all right? So that, over, that, that overcomes the problems of a first install. It will have a value of 50, all right? And we basically said if the if the top speed is greater than 100, just in case for some reason there's a problem with the slider or whatever it is, or you haven't set the slider up properly, we're saying, okay, if it's more than 100, it equals 100. And again, we've saved it, all right? Okay, there you go. Now, we need to actually get to this top speed value, which is in the car controller. We need to get this value here and change it with our slider using our script. So what we do is we basically say, look, this is the car top speed is equal to the top speed. So whichever value that we get from our player prefs, we're going to set that in the car controller script. Okay. And also the change the value of the slider. So the top speed slider value is equal to the um, top speed. All right. Good. So here what we do is we say, okay, down here, once we've done that, we can put a listener. A listener is something that will listen for changes in the top speed slider. And if it if it uh, sees or if it, if it finds a change in the value of the slider, the actual slider itself, it will run this function. And this will change the speed of the of the um, the vehicle uh, in the uh, car controller. Okay, and it make your car go faster or slower. Slower. Great, so let's have a look at this. So it says top speed equals the value of the slider, so it's a new value, and then we set the car's top speed to whatever this new value is, and then we save it, and that's all it does. Now, that's all well and good, but how do you access, how do you access the, the um, how do you access this value? Well, it's quite easy. If you open up the car controller script, which is this script here, okay, on this actual vehicle, which is from standard assets, what we do, yeah, is we quite simply say, look, the default, as it comes through, it says private float top speed equals 200. Well, what I've done is I've said, okay, 
we're going to make it a public float all right public float so that means we can get this value from outside of this script because we have said that we're using this standard assets vehicles car and we've grabbed the car controller in a wake it means that we can access this from this script you see these are the same right but here it says 200 and we're going to we're going to change that of our slider to whatever we want all right so let's have a look and see what happens <coughs> as you can see we've got our slider joined to our script and our script is joined to, is gaining getting the values from the car controller script using the standard assets vehicles car okay and here you go so we're looking at top speed coming to our engine and top speed yeah it works okay and that's all you need to do uh, to change the top speed of your vehicle and let's see if it, if it saves it well we're using player press so we've we'll set our top speed right up here just remember the slider position and it's 95 um, miles per hour let's stop the game and let's see if it remembers that this vehicle needs to go 95 miles an hour and the answer is yes it does okay so thanks very much for watching. Hope you learned something. Please um, subscribe and um, yeah, see you in the next video. And in the next video, we are going to deal with this one here, which is talk. Okay. Thank you and goodbye.